Hi, my name is Grace Darren, and today I'm doing two haircuts. Um, the first one is on my boyfriend, and I began by using a wide tooth comb and brushing through his hair. His hair has been shampooed and conditioned, um, so it's all saturated and wet. And now I'm sectioning his hair. Um, I tried to use the horseshoe method to get the top part um, and the bottom part separate so I could work with it that way. And then I was like, okay, wait, hold on. Like, I'm going to make a guide at the, like, um, in the middle first and then do the other sectioning. So that's what I'm doing now. Um, yep. So I am just going to start cutting the hair using a guide and it's going to be a moving guide. Um, yeah. And you can tell that I am like learning how to hold the scissors and comb and stuff like that. Um, I had some trouble occasionally. Um, also because I don't think that these shears fit my fingers correctly. Um, I had to keep adjusting that. Um, yeah, so then I took his hair down from the, the sectioning um, because I found it easier to work with that way. And he didn't want his hair super short, but he also like didn't want it long so I was kind of trying to do what the um, textbook said to do for the short layering hairstyle um, but yeah And I'm uh, cutting the hair using the palm to palm method, I believe is what it's called. Um, okay, so yeah, at this point, I have now sectioned the hair um, down the middle of his head, and I'm doing the bottom layer of hair. I'm trying to make it all uniform in all of that. And then I move on to the top, um, but just doing it on both sides of the head and the back. And um, any critique that you may have would be really helpful. Um, I still am like, this took so long because I'm very nervous about it, but um, I think it ended up being okay. Um, but yeah, so I'm now doing the top layer of hair using a moving guide um, around the head from one side around the back to the other side. Um, and then I check my work in the front to make sure that it's even on both sides. And I do a cross-checking occasionally throughout um, to make sure that it all uh, is even.
Um, and so now I'm going in with a razor, with a straight razor, um, and just kind of like make it a little more messy and texturized um, because he didn't want it to be super uniform and he likes to wear his hair super messy. So that's what I'm doing here. I'm just taking off a little bit of weight from the bulk of the hair. Um, the second cut I did, I didn't want to lose a lot of the length of this hair because I want to be able to practice with it more. Um, but I'm just doing like a soft layered haircut, um, starting by doing a horseshoe section, bottom layer, middle layer, top layer, and I'm just, um, yeah, doing that using a guide. And yeah. Um, this one was a lot easier, I think, mainly because it wasn't on a human, so I wasn't super worried about messing it up, but I also feel like it wasn't too hard, so, yeah.